Welcome to Adding Fractions with Unlike Denominators, 5th grade math standards of learning. When we're adding fractions with unlike denominators, we first have to find a common denominator. So we're going to use the listing method. We list the multiples of the denominators. Multiples of 4. Sixteen, twenty, etc. Multiples of five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. So we have listed the multiples of the denominators. So we're going to see. We're going to find the smallest number the smallest multiple that is common to both denominator and that is 20 so we're going to use 20 as our lcm so we're going to bring these fraction to equivalent fractions with a denominator of 20 What did we do to 4 to make 20? We multiply by 5. So we multiply by 5. Whatever we do to the denominator, we have to do to the dividend. So 5 times 1 is 5. What did... did what did we do to 5 to make it 20? Multiply by 4. Four times 2, 8. Now we have the common denominator. Now we can add the numerators. And that gives us. 8, I'm sorry, 8 plus 5, 13, over 20. Thirteen over 20. Next, 1 half plus 2 thirds. List. The multiples, we have two and we have three. Two, four, six, eight, three, six, nine, twelve. And the smallest num multiple that is common to two and three is six so six is our l c m or least common multiple so we're going to convert into equivalent fraction with a denominator of six what did we do to two to make six we multiply by three by three what did we do to three to make six we multiply by two 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 is four and now we have common denominators so now we can add the numerator when we add the numerator, that gives us 7 over 6. And 7 over 6 is an improper fraction, so we have to convert that to a mixed number. 
So to convert an improper fraction to a mixed number, we divide the numerator by the denominator. 7 divided by 6, 1, and the remainder 1, and we keep the same denominator. So our final answer is 7, 1 and 1, 6, that is to the lowest terms, or reducing it to, converting it to, a mixed number. Next, we have 5 twelfths plus 3 quarters plus 2 thirds. List the multiples. So we have 12, we have 4, and we have 3. So it's 12, 24, maybe we can leave that for now. We have 4, 8, 12, 16, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, Okay, so this will continue, this will continue, and this will continue. So our smallest common multiple, 12, 12, 12. So our LCM is 12. Twelve. 12, 12, so we're going with the 5 remains 5, because that would be multiplying by 1. Now how, what did we do to 4 to make it 12? We multiply by 3, so we multiply by 3, 3 times 3. 9. What did we do to 3 to make 12? We multiply by 4. 4 times 2, 8. And now we have all of our fraction with a common denominator. So now we're going to add our numerator. 9 and 8, 17 and 5. 22, so that is equal to 22 over 12. We're going to reduce that to, we're going to convert that to a mixed number. And that would give us 1 and 10. 1 and 10 over 12, 1 and 10 over 12, and we notice that 10 over 12 can be reduced to a lower term. So what we're going to do, we're going to divide both numerator and denominator by 2. And that would give us 1 and 5 over 6. And there you have it. Thanks for watching. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.